The first totally dry day this week, it seems, after days in and days out of rain chances and thunderstorms out there. Obviously, we had quite a bit of rain around our state. Take a look at some of these numbers since last Saturday. In Ames, close to four inches of rain, nearly three and a quarter inches in Des Moines, and many areas close to that at least inch and a half or two inch mark over the last several days. Now, we are going to mostly dry out over the next couple of days, especially going into this weekend. There is one small chance for rain coming tomorrow, but I don't think we'll see much in terms of measurable rain. So the rest of tonight is quiet and actually a little cool on late May standards at 7 o'clock. We'll be at 70 degrees clear conditions and notice by uh, 11 o'clock tonight we could be down to 60 degrees. That's a little chilly for the final Friday in May. As we go into the weekend, we will see a little rain chance coming in tomorrow. It'll be mainly in western and southwestern Iowa in the afternoon, although the metro could be clipped by this just for a short while. Any rain we do see should be very light and won't last all day, so definitely not a washout kind of day. As we go into Sunday, most of the day will be dry, and then we'll have to watch for another round of showers and possibly a few thunderstorms coming in by Monday morning. That'll be late Sunday night into early Monday morning. Again, some of us may miss out on that. Here's a closer view of what to expect as we go into tomorrow morning, 7 a.m. It'll be sunny, but it will be cool with temperatures in the low 50s outside as we head into the afternoon clouds will build and so will our scattered rain chances. Again, we may get some passing showers through the afternoon. I think most of these will be down in southwest Iowa, but again, close to I-80, we may get a little rain shower here or there. As we go into Sunday morning, more clouds will stick around. Not quite as cool, low to mid 50s outside, and we get just a little bit milder by Sunday afternoon with most areas returning to the upper 60s and low 70s. So a little cooler than average this weekend before a big time warm up comes in next week. Take a look at the temperature outlook going into really the middle and end of next week. We're talking about very warm temperatures, warmer than average, and we've got a big ridge of high pressure that will be developing. It'll bring some warm warm, toasty weather in by Monday, Tuesday, and into Wednesday as well. We'll also crank up the humidity. I think we've got the hottest temperatures so far this season heading our way. Take a look at some of the numbers. Once we get through the cool weekend, 82 on Monday. Yes, the first 90 degree temperature forecast on Tuesday and back to the mid 80s on Wednesday with a little rain chance. Just about everybody will have a shot at seeing the upper 80s or even close to 90 on Tuesday afternoon, so be prepared for that. The first real warm, warm weather of the season, and we may stay pretty toasty through the end of next week and into the first full weekend of June.